Hey everyone, welcome back to Racket Guys. Today we're taking a look at the Vocal V-Cell 10. Before we get started, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons to keep up with all of our latest content. Let's get started. My favorite thing about the V-Cell 10 was how maneuverable it was while still having a nice solid feel on impact. Uh, from the back of the court, I found the V-Cell 10 to have a lot of power, pretty easy access to spin. Uh, while it does have a higher stiffness rating of 69, the dampening in the handle does a lot to keep it feeling nice and comfortable. Uh, my favorite shot by far was the serve. I found it had a lot of power and spin, and because of how maneuverable the V-Cell 10 is, I was easily finding all of my spots on serve. Uh, the only real downside to this frame was the smaller sweet spot. Anything hit within the sweet spot felt super solid, but actually finding the sweet spot was a bit of a challenge for me. Uh, I think just a couple extra grams, probably right around three and nine, would go a really long way to make this frame feel a little bit more solid on pretty much any shot, actually. Uh, this does come in a 320 gram model, which would definitely play more stable, but I really like that Vocal came out with a lighter, easier to customize player's frame. Uh, I would definitely recommend this racket for any intermediate or advanced player looking for a lighter, more maneuverable player's frame. After hitting with the Vocal V-Cell 10, I found that it was a quite interesting frame. Most frames at 300 grams are quite powerful, but what sets the V-Cell 10 apart is that it's just quite the opposite. Being a light frame that offers control, and hitting ground strokes is where I noticed this the most. While it offered great control, I found that the sweet spot on the string bed was quite small, which made this frame a little bit unforgiving. But when perfect contact was made, the frame felt amazing, offering a solid but plush feel. I would recommend this frame for an intermediate level player looking for a lighter control frame on the market, or to an advanced player looking for a lighter frame to customize to their particular spec. Thanks everyone for watching. If you have any questions about the VSL 10 or have any suggestions of rackets that you want us to take a look at, please let us know down in the comments. As always, the Vocal VSL 10 is available on RacketGuys.com. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.